What's going on, Jurassic World fans? I'm Verdhammy Gaming here today, bringing you my predictions and thoughts for the sequel to Jurassic World: Jurassic World 2. Now, today we're going to be discussing the possibility of them introducing a brand new aquatic monster, that being the Megalodon. Now, in real life, guys, the Megalodon was known as the largest predator to ever roam the ocean. Literally, it was absolutely huge. And what better, you know, animal to be featured in another Jurassic World movie than the Megalodon? Now, of course, the only, uh, you know, aquatic you know monster we had in Jurassic World was the Mosasaur and the Mosasaur was absolutely amazing the way it came out the Indominus Rex the way it was actually eating a grown uh, you know fully grown great white shark was awesome as well but what if they decided to add more aquatic monsters in the film such as you know the plesiosaurs and whatnot in particular the Megalodon now I, I personally believe that given the old motto especially in Jurassic World bigger louder and more teeth I think it doesn't come any bigger uh, than the Megalodon now for me personally Personally, I think that the Megalodon should be introduced, um, especially to have something, uh, you know, rival the Mosasaur, because as we saw in Jurassic World, the Mosasaur was the largest animal within the entire park, um, being contained in a very large pool. It was an absolute monster in and of itself. But what if they decided to add and resurrect the Megalodon? Like, now, I, I personally think bringing back a 70 to 80 foot shark is just terrifying enough. And of course, they can always have the Mosasaur battle the Megalodon and what like that, like that. That would be absolutely amazing. Um, they could always go down a different path where, you know, the Megalodon escapes or probably the Mosasaur escapes from, like, its captivity and whatnot. And then, and then we, we, we get to see, like, the Mosasaur and the Megalodon throw down as they meet up, you know, uh, since given the fact that both pools are, you know, pretty much broken right now and whatnot, it, it, it would have been absolutely amazing to see. Now, of course, um, given that fact, I think that personally for me, the Megalodon should definitely be introduced and perhaps maybe even feed the Megalodon um, other dinosaurs. I mean, you know, like baby dinosaurs and whatnot, like, that would be absolutely awesome awesome to see. If they decide uh, to have, you know, aquatic monsters throw down, I think the Mosasaur should throw down with the Megalodon if if given circumstances come about, like let's say for example they both escape and they end up crossing each other's paths and stuff like that, like that would be awesome or for, or if, if for example, you know, they decide to have the Spinosaurus in the movie and the Spinosaurus gets knocked off into the pool and whatnot, since since we already know that the Spinosaurus is also an aquatic, you know, monster, uh, the Spinosaurus is in the pool, he's trying to come out and the next thing you know, like the Megalodon just like grabs it whole and just like tears it apart and stuff like that, like that, like that would be absolutely amazing. Um, the sheer power of the Megalodon's jaws are just so immense it would be able to crush any dinosaur in its path so for me personally um i think if they if they want to do something different i think introducing the megalodon would definitely be something awesome because like i said guys uh realistically people fear sharks and it, it just doesn't get any more terrifying than having a grown monster freakazoid of a shark that stretches about 80 to like you know 85 feet known as the megalodon you know like have it battle other dinosaurs and whatnot perhaps maybe there can be a scene where certain dinosaurs are getting knocked off into the pool and it becomes like a feeding frenzy for the mosasaur for the megalodon and stuff like that so even though we already know that the megalodon is a shark there is absolutely no way it can go on the land um you know scratching off sharknado of course but uh you know like they, they, they could have other dinosaurs that are that have both uh land and you know ocean you know, uh, characteristics come about like the, the Spinosaurus. The Spinosaurus uh, can actually go in the water and travel on land. So maybe that right there could be uh, some sort of key feature to where it's it's you know resurrected once again, and something happens to where like you know the Spinosaurus gets you know knocked into the water or it goes into the water, and then it becomes like food for the Megalodon and stuff like that. Or maybe even the Spinosaurus tries to fight off the Megalodon, and the Megalodon just tears it apart. Like that right there would be absolutely awesome. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below about a possible Megalodon introduction. Do you guys think? It would work do you guys think it would be cool um what are your overall thoughts on them bringing a megalodon into a movie such as jurassic world 2 how would they even you know conjure up that kind of an idea let me know in the comment section below guys once again thank you all for watching if you guys are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe leave your thoughts in the comment section below smash that like button guys for me personally like i said i mean having one aquatic monster in jurassic world was cool but then again, all you really had was a giant creature by the name of Mosasaur swimming around in its own pool. I mean, it, it was only a matter of time before he had the spotlight because we knew that there wasn't any other creature out there that could rival it in terms of being in the ocean. So why not have, you know, the uh, the Indominus Rex uh, be force fed into the Mosasaurus? I mean, like, even though it was a really cool scene, I think that they should build off that and possibly have the Mosasaur throw down with the Megalodon. Who knows? I mean, the possibilities are endless. I just think the Megalodon should be added because, again, it was one of the largest uh, known sharks ever to live. 
in, in our world and i think like having that come about would be absolutely awesome so let me know what you guys think thank you all for watching once again stay tuned for more and i'll be seeing you all later guys take it easy peace